hi guys welcome back to my channel today i'm gonna make some jamaican steam cabbage yes so these are all of my ingredients that i'll be using i'm gonna start off with my seasoning here i have a half teaspoon of all-purpose seasoning half teaspoon of black pepper and half teaspoon of salt i also have half of cabbage that i cut these are my bell peppers and i'm using half as you can see, I've got all the color, green, red, and yellow. I also have one carrot that I cut, scotch bonnet pepper, just a small amount because you don't want it to be so, so spicy. Half of onion, I'm using red onion. You can always use white onion that I cut also. One teaspoon of fresh thyme and three cloves of garlic, okay? Guys, don't forget to share this video to your families, to your friends. And everyone on your social media I will really really appreciate it I thank you all so much stay tuned so guys I'm gonna start off by cutting my cabbage and I wash it also okay I'm gonna remove this part the top part and I'm just gonna cut it like so Or if you want you can just you know cut it in your hand like so we have to be careful though especially if you're not used to it if you're not used to it you don't do it you do it on the board okay so you want to thinly cut it or maybe not so thin So this is just the hard part of the cabbage and you don't need it, you can just cut around it. Yeah, that should not have been. I'm going to take it, put them in my bowl right here. Guys, with the bell peppers, I'm gonna show you and how I cut it. You just wanna finely cut it, okay? You can cut it a bit more smaller, but I like to cut it long like this, okay? Just like so. And the carrot also, I remove the peel from my carrot. You can use a knife, then I finally, finally cut it. Just like so. Yeah, just like so, okay? So guys, here I have my pot and my stove, and my stove is on a low heat, okay? And to my pot, I add a some vegetable oil and I add at least one tablespoon you don't need no more oil that's it okay so now that my pot and my oil is heated up I'm gonna firstly add my garlic with my onions okay just like so I'm just gonna leave it for at least 20 seconds okay So guys, this is what it looks like just after 20 seconds. So now I have a tomato, some tomato and I'm going to add one tomato that I cut. Just like so. Then I'm going to add my carrot. Just 
We're just gonna leave this carrot guys to stir fry for at least 15 seconds, okay? And now I'm gonna add my bell peppers. Guys, it looks so good. I'm just gonna leave it to saute, guys, for at least 10 to 15 seconds, okay? I'm gonna also add my scotch bunny pepper. I'm gonna blend my season together and I'm gonna add some of my season and this is just after 15 seconds, okay? So also add my fresh thyme. And now I'm gonna add my cabbage. Mix it all in. Guys, it smells so good. So guys, this is totally optional, but I'm gonna add at least one teaspoon of my butter. And it's just gonna add a nice flavor. So now guys, I'm gonna add my seasoning. gonna mix it all in I'm just loving the color it looks so delicious this is very simple guys simple simple recipe simple but yet delicious so guys I'm just gonna leave it for at least six minutes six to five minutes okay I'm going to add at least one tablespoon of water and that's it because you don't need a lot of water. I'm going to cover my pot and make sure your stove is in a low heat, okay? See you back. So guys, it is all finished. Look at that. It looks super, super delicious. Oh my gosh, it looks so good guys. If you want, you can always allow it to cook more softer. But this is perfect guys. Perfect. This is the perfect steamed cabbage you will ever have. And it's so flavorful. So, so flavorful guys.
so guys i'm just plating up my steamed cabbage and i'm telling you it looking super super delicious i cannot wait for you guys to try this recipe if you try it don't forget to comment below and tell me what it's like i'm telling you it looking so mouth watering guys you can serve it with whatever you preferred okay i thank you all so much for watching this video i hope you guys do enjoy it don't forget to share it to your families to your friends and everyone on your social media i will really really appreciate it and don't forget also to give me a thumbs up okay i thank you all so much until next time bye stay blessed